One area family wants to thank Plymouth First Responders in a big way. I explain what led to Thank a Hero Day and how you can help. We're going to go post right side. Okay. March is especially meaningful for the Holmstrom family. What? That's because just four years ago, their lives changed forever. Oh! Lincoln was only three. He was outside playing in the backyard with his six-year-old brother, Brody, and my husband was in the garage. Christy says the boys got adventurous, and Lincoln fell in a creek. We heard screams. I was kind of scared. After Brody called for his parents, his dad, Josh, ran down and jumped in. I couldn't find him right away. There was a bunch of branches kind of making a little dam there, and that's where he was. So I remember turning around, and I had Lincoln in my arms, and I was yelling at her to call 911, and she said, I already did. And then I literally, it was like seconds later, I could hear the sirens of them coming. The operator talked Christy through CPR until the Plymouth officers arrived. I remember a tap on my shoulder, and that was the police officers like, you're done now, it's our turn. The family thought they lost their son, but first responders revived him. I remember they gave me a couple of popsicles. That's all we remember from the hospital, so that's good. And officers kept checking in. These people truly care so much about the people that they serve. Even after Lincoln recovered. They answered the door and this man said, I've been driving by over and over waiting to see a vehicle. And Lincoln came running down the stairs and tears filled his eyes. The family wanted to give back to those who saved his life. They're just like, I was just doing my job. And to me, like, you saved my child's life. Since Lincoln's first Miracle Day, the Holmstroms return to celebrate Lincoln and his heroes each year. Thank you very much and we would give them really good gifts. Oh, we would give them gifts. Christy says the death of three Burnsville first responders made her family reflect in a different way. They were just going to a call and this is where it hit me of this year I didn't want it to be just our family celebrating Lincoln's Miracle Day. I really wanted the community of Plymouth to come together. This year, the family is extending Lincoln's Miracle Day to all Plymouth heroes. Love this one. Everybody's getting some lifesavers because they are lifesavers. That's everyone. The 170 person fleet of police officers, emergency medical staff, and firefighters. The gratitude we feel is a lot. There he goes. We're so lucky that he's there. So it's good to be whole because of them, you know. The family is still looking for donations to fill 170 gift bags, and there are several ways you can help. We'll share a link at ccxmedia.org. Find more local news stories at ccxmedia.org and follow us on social media.